Hello, I'm back. Um, this is part two, so I had to wait a few days for the other two um, mystery kits to come in, but they've come in now. Um, this one here is the first one we're going to open up today, and it's from a company called mysterykits.co.uk. Um, I will put the links to the websites in the description of the video. Um, like I said, I am not affiliated with anybody, I'm just simply buying mystery shirts um, as a fun little hobby. I'm not expecting too much from them. The, the first one that I opened up earlier wasn't too bad. It was a Ranger shirt. Um, it's sort of a rare one as well because it hasn't got the sponsorship on the shirt as well. I did ask a few Rangers fans um, if it was a prop, like um, it's a 4XL because it's, it's for me. Um, if it was say like a large or an XL, it, I probably could have got a decent um, amount of money maybe for it. Um, but, of the fact that it hasn't got the sponsorship logos some rangers fans said they prefer it not to have the sponsorship logo on it so but i'm not going to sell it anyway because i quite like it and i'm um, trying to build a little small collection of random football shirts to wear for my uh streaming videos and stuff like that really so yeah so anyway let's get started this is mysterykits.co.uk as i said so i'm just going to open this bad boy up um, trying to do it without getting anything spoiled. Um, trying not to. There we go. Right. Let's move that out of the way first so it doesn't spoil anything. So, all I can see, it's a red shirt. Oh, okay. This is actually quite nice. Um, Bay Monique shirt. Yeah, can you see that right? Yeah, Bayon Monique shirt. Red is my favourite colour and it actually goes with the mask as well. So that's good. It is uh, originally $69.99. I wouldn't have thought it is that though. Um, trying to figure out what year it says. Let's have a look on here. Uh, oh, I'll have a look offline or something, but... Not too bad. Quite a nice shirt. Oh yeah. Not too bad. Yeah. Okay. Not too bad. T Mobile. Like I said, sort of goes with the mask as well. Adidas. Very nice. Um let me know in the comments section what you think. So so far we've had a Rangers one and a Bay Minute one. The Bay Minute one's probably the best one so far out of the two out of the two. No offense to Rangers. So, right, so, sorry about that, if everybody saw that. Um, right, the next one is from a website called Mystery Football. Uh, let me just get the correct website so I can get it just right. Mysteryfootball.co.uk. So, the reason I went for this one is because they have a lot of different choices, and one of them was uh, a summer summary one. So, I've gone for the summary one here. So let's see. Oh, actually, sorry, I forgot to read this first. Uh, that's from mysterykits.co.uk. Just says Bay Mini. I still need to look at what year it is. But anyway, all right, let's open up this one. Uh, let's just see if there's anything in here. We'll just put that to the side there. All right. Oh, you are joking me. I've already got this one. Oh, that's so annoying. I've already got this one. Um, Shore, Shoreline, Shoreline United. Uh, I don't have to message them, email them tomorrow, see if I can return this and get a different one. But yeah, I'm not going to bother putting this one on. Um, but it's a nice shirt. I've already got it. I got it from a different... Uh, I, got it from, I got this one from surpriseshirts.co.uk so yeah anyway um, yeah let me know what you think in the comment section let me know if there's any uh, mystery football websites you've tried that you think I would get a decent shirt from or you want me to try um, just let me know in the comment section and I'll do a little review but yeah thanks sorry if you saw my belly at that at some point um, I do apologise I hope I haven't put you off your dinner Anyway, I'll uh, 
I'll do another one next month, probably get a couple more next month and then see how it goes from there, really. I'll also let you know on my community tab how I get on with uh, seeing if I can return that shirt and get a different one from mysteryfootball.co.uk. So anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, did well with the Rangers one, the Bay Munich one. It wasn't Mystery Football's fault that they gave me the Shoreline one. They weren't to know that I've already had it. So I need to let them know. And hopefully it'll be easy enough transaction where I can just return the shirt and they send me out a new one. Fingers crossed. We'll see. If they don't, I obviously probably won't buy anything off them again. So we'll have to see. Anyway, I'll see you soon. All the best. Bye.